Introduced roughly 100 years ago, plastic has quickly become one of the most commonly used products and has become indispensable to people's everyday lives. Plastics are lightweight, durable, and cheap, making them incredibly versatile and convenient to use. These same properties are also the reason that plastic poses a serious threat to the marine environment. Plastic is not easily biodegradable and can remain in the ocean for years. Plastics are divided into two categories based on their size. Microplastics are usually fragments of larger plastics and have been degraded to the point where they are undetectable, and they are the most common in the ocean. When the problem was first noticed, the consensus was that plastic pollution was insignificant and had no real effect on the marine environment, although the opposite is turning out to be true. Plastic pollution continues to increase at an alarming rate. And by the year 2050, it is predicted that there will be more plastic in the ocean than fish. Over 180 species of marine life, including birds, whales, invertebrate, and fish, have been found to have ingested or been entangled in plastic. Microplastics get trapped in the stomachs of marine species causing ulceration and fullness, stopping them from eating real food. are vital to the ocean as they are home to more than 25% of marine life. scientists and marine biologists are all in agreement that plastic pollution is a major threat to the marine environment. More and more aquatic organisms are dying because of the large amounts of plastic in the ocean.
If a solution is not found, this problem will have even worse impacts on the ocean and the marine ecosystem, and eventually on humans as well. The plastic problem is not going anywhere, and its effects are quickly becoming irreversible. The search for an effective and long-term solution should be a priority to help ensure that we protect places like my beautiful home.